Carbon storage is an important tool in the fight against climate change. Removing some of the 32 billion tons of carbon dioxide we release into the atmosphere every year, which warms our planet. Now, there are many ways we can store carbon from planting trees to capturing it and injecting it underground. But new research suggests we may have been seriously underestimating one of our best technologies, biochar. The biochar is the product of high temperature decomposition of plant matter in an oxygen limited environment into a type of charcoal. Now, this essentially follows on from the process of photosynthesis, where plants use sunlight to turn carbon dioxide into biomass, and taking the next step to convert that biomass into a more stable, solid carbon form, where it can remain for millions of years. When calculating global carbon budgets, the IPCC and European policymakers use models estimating the carbon storage capabilities of technologies like biochar to make decisions on climate policy. Yet, it's thought the existing models vastly underestimate the stability of biochar in the long-term storage of carbon, and thus limiting its integration into these budgets. New research re-evaluated carbon degradation rates and showed that biochar might be much more stable than we previously thought, suggesting it might soon take centre stage as an effective, scalable and permanent carbon dioxide removal technology.